So you started school in the middle of a pandemic. Everyone's wearing masks, very little is open, and the news is full of doom and gloom. Well, look on the bright side. With no morning commute, there's no traffic to deal with and no need to search for that elusive parking spot. If you're a transit commuter, you don't have to deal with that bad body odor next to you. Snacks and drinks are much cheaper. Mom, what's for lunch? You don't have to wake up early. Even if you have an 8 a.m. class, you only have to wake up at a quarter to eight, grab some breakfast, bring it to your workstation, and settle in. You can wear whatever you want or nothing at all and no one will notice. If you choose the naked option, please ensure your camera is turned off. And if your prof has some video skills, their recorded lectures will be as fun as watching Netflix. So what about the nuts and bolts of attending remote class? These are the questions we get asked the most. Should I attend live classes? Yes, you should. It's more fun, you get to interact with your professor and your fellow students, ask questions in real time, and research shows that those who attend classes earn better grades. While you're attending, create a fun avatar. What if I miss class? Don't worry, your professor will record all classes and post them in a place you can find them. How do I do group work? You can create a group workspace in Microsoft Teams where you can work together on the same files, talk about the project, and hold meetings. Be sure to have weekly status meetings to keep everyone on track and be mindful that students will be in different time zones. Generally speaking, the mornings in North American Eastern time zone will be most convenient for those in Europe, the Middle East, South Asia, and East Asia. How do I submit an assignment? All your assignments will be in Blackboard in the Assignments tab. Just click on it, find the assignment, upload any files you need, and click Submit. What equipment do I need? At minimum, you should have a laptop computer with a built-in webcam and a headset, preferably one with a microphone attached. Optional upgrades would include a second monitor, a dedicated webcam, an external microphone, an ergonomic chair, and of course, drinks and snacks. Lots and lots of snacks. Remote learning has its challenges, but at Seneca, our attitude is challenge accepted. While we don't get to physically be together, we can still learn together.